Okay, first graders, let's talk about making the next 10 to add again. Look here, I'm gonna solve 28 plus five. I'm gonna make it easy on myself and make the next 10. 28, how many do I need to add to get to the next 10? If I'm at 28, I need to go 28, 29, 30. I need two more to get to 30. Now I can take a two out of this five. You can see I have five here. If I took this two out of it, there would be how many left? Three. That makes sense. Two and three together make five. I'm going to break up the five into two and three. Now I'm going to take my two and I'm going to bring it over to my 28 because that will help me make the next 10. Now I know. 28 plus 2 equals 30. I'm going to put the 28 and 2 together to make 30. Here I have 30. And how many do I have left? 3. 30 plus 3 is easy. It just equals 33. Breaking up the 5 and making the next 10 made it easier. I can also show you like this. If I know, if I want to solve 28 plus 5, and I know 28 plus 2 equals 30. Then I just need to add 3 more. And I know 30 plus 3 equals 33. I broke up the 5 into 2 and 3. Watch me solve another one. Now I'm going to solve 33 plus 9. Again, I'm going to make the next 10. So if I'm at 33, I know I need 7 more to make the t next 10. I know that because three plus seven equals 10. So that means 33 plus seven equals 40. I get to the next 10. If I have three tens, the next 10 is four tens. I'm gonna try to add seven. That means I wanna take a seven out of this nine. I'm gonna break up the nine into seven in something else. Let's see how many I would have left if I took out seven from nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There are two more. That's because seven plus two will equal nine. I'm gonna take this seven, I'm gonna use it to help us. Look, I can take this seven and add it to my 33. That's how I show it in the equation. In the picture, I can do it like this. I can bring my seven over. Now I've filled that 10. Now there are 10, 20, 30, 40. That's because 33 plus seven will equal 40. I have 40 over here. How many ones? Two. 40 plus two is easy. It equals 42. We made the next 10 to make it easier. Now let me show you how to use what you learned to do your work. Here's gonna be your job. Look at this first question. How many to make the next 10? 54 plus what equals 60? Get ready. Put 54 in your head. We're gonna stop when we equal 60. 54. 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60. How many do we have to add? Six. You're gonna put six here. Now, you're gonna use that to help you solve the next one. So look, here's 54 again, just like we had up here. We're gonna try to add eight to 54. We broke up eight into six and two. Now you know that 54 plus six equals 60 because you solved it up here. So if I put the 54 and the six together, it's gonna be 60. Then I just need to add two more. It's gonna equal 62. Now you're gonna go do the next one. How many to make the next 10? 55 plus what will equal 60? Start at 55, count on until you get to 60. Then you're gonna use that to solve 55 plus seven. If you have any questions, you can log on to the um, Google Hangout to ask.